Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before starting the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and give this video a like up. The author's and his alone's views on B&B &B are expressed here. They're usually right on point, properly biting and amusing. Every fan has a distinct perspective about the bold and the beautiful, and Soap Hub is no exception. We observed everything that happened over the course of five days, the good, the bad, and everything in between, and are providing you with a helpful assessment and a light-hearted analysis of B and B's week. And here I was hoping that because the mutually supportive duo has been a part of the bold and the beautiful for ten years, the show would truly look out for Lawrence St. Victor and Carter Walton. In contrast, Carter received a brand new desk accessory, a handshake from Eric, John McCook, and a hug from Steffi, Jacqueline McKinswood, while St. Victor was given a minute-long montage of meetings that his character led and a brief scene in which he hung out with Ridge, Thorsten K., set to some wistful music. Good then. The character hasn't exactly been involved in a ton of love triangles or emotionally taxing scenes. Ugh. This show consistently gets things horribly wrong, despite their best efforts. Objurgations will follow, but I would be negligent if I didn't acknowledge that the Friday air show's structure really impressed me. I don't think I've ever seen that many main characters in a single show, let alone two distinct tales that were intertwined, it had to be a new employee. I'm still perplexed by the Bill slash Sheila slash Deacon love triangle, which isn't actually a triangle because Bill Don Diamond is unaware that Sheila is a rival for his attention, Kimberlyn Brown, Asterisk Lee, Naomi Matsuda, and Finn, Tanner Novlin, have been working at the same hospital since when. It's already been established that she works at a different hospital, Asterisk the bold and the beautiful, please say show me that Thomas, Matthew Atkinson, is seeing a psychiatrist and attempting to improve himself rather than telling me that he is. Speaking of showing versus telling, wouldn't it have been better to see Steffi, Jacqueline McKinswood, truly struggle to believe the story Thomas is feeding her as opposed to seeing her turn around and apologize to him right away? Moments like Thomas' return to the company and Steffi's welcome to him need to seem earned rather than fabricated and created out of thin air. I'd advise better, but the best in my opinion is this. Weekdays on CBS, the bold and the beautiful B&B &B is broadcast. For airtimes, check your neighborhood listings. Visit B&B &B Spoilers for the most recent information on what is happening in Los Angeles and go here for a detailed look at the show's history. Join the discussion on our Facebook page, peruse our Twitter feed, or keep an eye out for an update on our Instagram stories to learn more about what's happening on your favorite soap operas. I'll see you there. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and stay with us.